Hi guys, thanks for joining me for another What's Eight in a Day as a Vegan on the Swimming World. Sorry, I'm just laughing at my hair because um, I've just blow dried it, but I've not actually <laughs> brushed it, so it looks bizarre. Anyway, um, it's actually Saturday, so happy Saturday, and it is currently like half past four. Um, I have had two coffees today, uh, each with 100 mils of alcohol. I'm a barista for one sin each, so I'm on two sins. Um, I'm just making some food because I'm really hungry. Um, yeah, basically the time has got away from me, so I've not eaten anything yet today, so I am starving. So I'm gonna have, um, I, I'm a little bit low on like supplies, so I'm improvising, this is a bit weird, but I think it's gonna work. So I'm actually um, pan frying an aubergine. <laughs> um, and it may surprise you to know what I'm gonna do with this aubergine, but um, that's that. So what it's uh, cooking in is, this this is just spray olive oil um and i've used six sprays which was probably two more than i needed but that's fine um so that's six sins because it's one sin a spray and in the air fryer i have some linda mccartney red onion and rosemary sausages cooking so what i'm making is <laughs> essentially a sausage sandwich but because I haven't got any salad stuff <laughs> I was like what vegetable can I use hence the aubergines it's always like a burger but with sausages an aubergine and no sauce but the aubergine will be juicy so I reckon it'll be okay anyway there's two slices on each of this underneath the sausages and then I'm just gonna ow 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 put the other ones on top like that here we go you guys know I love my seasoning. I've just seasoned my aubergine just with Slap Your Mama. So where we are then, it was six sins for the oil for the aubergine, slightly excessive, but whatever. Uh, the bread roll, uh, one is healthy extra B, the other one is six sins. So it's 12 sins total for this. That puts me on 40, excuse me, 14 for the day so far. Uh, I'm starving, so I'm gonna go eat. Okay, bye. Just wanted to show you quickly, because they look good, right? I know there's no sauce on them, but I figured the aubergine will be juicy enough to compensate. My, what ghostly lighting. <laughs> um, it's far later in the evening than it should be, but I'm just making some dinner because I'm hungry. Um, I'm just going to make, I'm going to call it a chickpea stew. <laughs> so these are the vegetables I'll be using. I've just got a large white onion, a red pepper, a courgette and two carrots. I'll also be using two tins of chickpeas and two tins of chopped tomatoes. My peppers are big and, um, sorry, my veggies are big and fat like this because I'm just gonna chop them using my vegetable chopper and that way they will become the same size, similar in size to a chickpea. Um, if you do have one of these like style choppers, I appreciate there's tons of different brands and all the rest of it, but the, the trick is just run this under water before you do it. If it's wet, it works really well. It's so satisfying if you have rage or just feel really down like me. <laughs> um, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't uh, feeling pretty blue <laughs> at the moment because of Delta, but you know, it is what it is. Oh, I knew it was too big, damn it. Look at that, so easy. The nice thing is with this particular one, and I assume pretty much all of them, but this one comes with a lid. So you can just, if you wanted to do prep, you could just chop veggies up and then just put the lid on and keep it in the fridge ready. Just so useful. I just always forget I've got it. <laughs> um, but yes, there we go. I'm just gonna saute off this veg, find some spices, add the chickpeas and tomatoes, and that's essentially gonna be it. For reference, I've used three sprays of the same oil as earlier, so that's three sins in this. And also I've added loads of garlic on top, just chopped really chunkily. Um, I've used four large cloves, so it should be nice and garlicky, which, you know, in my book, that's never a bad thing because garlic is life. <laughs> okay, it's been 10, 15 minutes maybe and my veggies have cooked down quite nicely so I'm just going to add in my chickpeas. I always just drain and rinse them in the can it's just easier and yes randomly these are Amazon brand. <laughs> I just buy them in bulk off Amazon. <laughs> 
for spices, I'm going to use uh, hot chilli, smoked paprika and cumin. I'm not going to measure it. What a rebel. Just can't be bothered. Decent amount of hot chilli. 50 billion tonnes of smoked paprika. Because it's life. How much cumin's in there? All of that cumin. Sorted. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just give that a little mix around then I'm going to add in a vegetable stock cube so that'll give some saltiness and some herby flavours and also my tins of tomatoes it's pretty much going to be it to be honest and then I'll add salt like to serve rather than within it because the stock cube obviously is salty just very aware that I do eat a fair amount of salt. I just like it. <laughs> oh, it smells good. Really good. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm just using one of the Knorr vegetable gel pots for my stock cube. This is actually a gluten-free one. I don't know if I've just been gypped into buying a more expensive one, but I'm sure this was the only option. They didn't have the normal ones. I don't know if these are just the normal ones now. I don't think they are because the packet colour is different, but whatever. Anyway, that'll melt down. And I'm just going to add in my tinned tomatoes. I don't know why I'm showing you. It's not that interesting. It's putting tomatoes in a bowl. <laughs> okay, so I have split it into three. That way I know what my sins are. Um, so each of these is one sin each because it was just the oil. And sorry, I just licked the spoon and I've just eaten a piece of garlic, which wasn't quite cooked. <laughs> Maybe I should have cooked it longer, but that's fine. Anyway, um, so this is my one for tonight. I'm going to top it with some cheese. Um, so this is both my healthy extra A's. Although I'm thinking probably one would have done. <laughs> oh, well. Um, if I ate another one of these tonight, if I wasn't satisfied with this one, it's absolutely not the end of the world. It's just one more sin. If not, these will go very nicely with rice or pasta or on their own or water them down and make them into soup. Like there's tons I can do with this. So yeah, just a useful, useful thing to have in the fridge. But for now, this is the one I'm having tonight. I guess I'll put all this on. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was 60 grams. I just feel like, I don't know, whatever, I'm going to call it both and we'll just see. Um, and I'll probably put some Slap Your Mama on top as well. As you all know, my favourite seasoning. This one's virtually empty, but luckily, yeah, it's like the last dregs. Luckily, I do have spare because, you know, I'm fairly organised sometimes. <laughs> hey guys, so it's basically bedtime now. Um, I did have a second bowl of that chickpea stew it was really really tasty so wholesome so hearty just exactly what I wanted um so I've got a portion left for another day which is great so that was just two sins so that puts me on 16 for the day which is nice let me just show you my diary okay um here's today's diary page so just two sins for my almond milk uh six sins for oil at lunch and six for a second roll and then two sins for the two sprays of oil used at dinner time. And that's literally it. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's not really a lot to say about today. Um, I, I've been, I've been particularly down today, it must be said. I, I'm in a really weird mood. I just, yeah, I don't quite know what to do with myself. But anyway, um, just wanted to show you yesterday's page. Um, as well quickly because I know I didn't at the end of yesterday's video so uh, that was it finishing on 25 and there we go so yeah finishing 16 today which is lovely um as I said been in a bit of a weird mood um obviously I'm really down about you know losing Delta thus I imagine not gonna go away anytime soon um but I just feel very odd <laughs> so I've been doing some colouring um, there's a site I really like called Sugar and Sloth and they've got loads of really cute, like, good mental health stuff. Um, so I downloaded some free colouring pages from them. They sell them as well. 
Um, they've got loads of fun stuff, but like, they're so cute, like their little characters. Um, so here's some of the coloring I've been doing. This one isn't finished yet. It's a little dinosaur. Thoughts, aunt facts, eat some snacks. <laughs> this is one I did yesterday. It's a little kitty cat with a strawberry on his head. Just say no to everything. That's what I feel like at the moment. And then I also did this one yesterday. Majestically awkward, it's a little badger. And I decided to make him blue on a pink unicorn because why not? So I thought that was quite cute. We should all feel majestically awkward sometimes. <laughs> and then um, I did this one today. <laughs> it's a little bee. It says everything sucks, but at least I have cute coloring pages. I didn't really get very creative with this one, but look how cute he is. Look at that little bee. I made him blue because I thought that was cute. <laughs> and then obviously today's little dinosaur eating some cookies. So I need to finish the cookies and the words and I'll do that tomorrow, I expect. But yeah, um, it's just nice mindlessly coloring really. <laughs> Um, but yeah, um, I do recommend this website. They've got so much really, really lovely stuff on there. Like, you know, even if, <laughs> even if you don't kind of <laughs> struggle a bit with your mental health, like <laughs> it's just some really nice stuff on there. Some really positive things on it. Um, and like I said, they're so cute. So check them out, Sugar and Sloth. Oh, yeah. That's not a promotion. I've got no affiliation with them. <laughs> Just, just a site I like. Um, I'm gonna order their Tiny Hug Club membership. They do like a subscription box every month. And it's only about 15 pounds and you just get a few little things in there. Like it's really cute um, and very healthy, I think. It's very healthy. So yeah, I'm probably gonna sign up to that uh, next month. So yeah, um, that's me done for the day. Um, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.